Hello, hello, obrigada, and welcome back to another vlog. In this week's episode, we are wrapping up the Portugal series, which has me feeling a little bit sad to see it come to an end. But hey, we've got a lot of fun coming up in Barcelona in the next few weeks. So be sure to subscribe so that you don't miss out on a thing. So far in this series, we've visited hotspots in Old Town, seen the famous library and indulged in a lengthy port wine tasting. One of the biggest highlights here has definitely been the cuisine and I am salivating just reminiscing over all the food we've demolished here. Seriously guys, talk about a snack attack! But all food fiestas aside, this trip has been so much fun and I cannot wait for you to see what's coming up in today's vlog. So guys, that is enough shit talking on my end for now. Let's get straight into it. Guys, 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 look at these shots in the old town. I mean, hot damn, or as Ali G would like to say, booyakasha. Seriously though, when the sun came out to play, all the colors in the streets were popping and I couldn't help but truck up the drone. We traveled here in late September, but I couldn't imagine how hectic it would have been if we had come in July or August. And that's honestly one of my favorite things about traveling during the off season. The lack of people just makes things so much better. Despite all the crowds of people, the views and the entire feel of this part of Porto could not have gotten any better. So after soaking up the sunshine, we jumped aboard a boat cruise on the Douro River. I usually try to avoid really touristy things like this when I travel, but this was a great way to learn about the history and catch a different perspective on the city. Uh, I am notoriously seasick and somehow we are on a boat cruise, but hey, no regrets. If I vomit, I'll make sure to film it for you guys, don't worry. Wow, but I say una película. I'm really grateful the sun's come out. Holy fuck, what a difference it makes. Also, the view from here is so pretty, so, so nice. Right now, we're on the side of Villanova de Gaia, which is known for all the wine cellars and all that. Okay, so we did the cruise. It was good. It was 18 euros each and I got seasick. So would I do it again? I mean, yes, but yeah. Anyways, it was worth it. However, we got off on the wrong side. So now we've got to walk half an hour back, I think. Half an hour back and we're going to go to get some food in a random restaurant. And uh, yeah, that's about it. We've got a few more hours left until the airport. So we're just taking it easy. Barbara is waiting for me somewhere over there. I can't see here, but it's time to go. Okay. This dude up here is about to jump into the water. Fuck. 
me up. Que bolas. It's cold, by the way. It's like 19 degrees or something like that. Something crazy. I don't know. This is some crazy sh**. Oh, you are afraid? I'm afraid. Whoa. Oh my god. Que loco. Vale, un, dos, tres, ya. He's crazy, bro. This is insane. Ahí. What's that, guys? What's that? Oh, he's saying subscribe. Sh Quick pause just to quickly say that what you're about to see unfold was probably the biggest highlight of the trip for me. We ran into this lady who had one of those 360 dance circle selfie things. Sorry, I do not know the name, lol. But of course we had to give it a go. We were dancing in public and laughing so hard. Oh man. I wish I could put the actual song on here, but I can't because of copyright reasons. So maybe I'll just sing a part of it for you. <coughs> here we go, I guess. Dale a tu cuerpo alegría. <laughs> I can't do this, okay. <clears throat> Let me try it again. Dale a tu cuerpo alegría, Macarena. Que tu cuerpo es para darle alegría, cosa buena. Dale a tu cuerpo alegría, Macarena. Eh, hey, Macarena. Ow! Oh yeah, fucking fuck, guys. This was so much fun. Oh, if I could go back and do it all over again, I totally would. There is nothing quite like making a fool of yourself in public, especially when you're traveling with your friends. That was so fun. That was so un poco fun. De cardio, tu mismo. Yeah, un poco, un poco de cardio. cardio. Sí, sí. That was so good. I totally rate it. It was only 10 euros as well. La Macarena. We're going to chuck the video up in three, two, one. Woo! So many fucking steps. Which I hadn't there. They have my favorite pasta ever, cacio e pepe. I am 100% getting that. And the prices are pretty good. They're pretty standard. Keen as f Also hungry as f so let's order. It's wine o'clock, ladies and gentlemen. Let's get lit as a trip. I'm just kidding. No one's getting lit. We've got to go to the airport in several hours. So I'm keeping it responsible. Not like yesterday when I had four glasses of port wine and then another bottle of wine later. That's not me. I don't drink. But here we are drinking. So. You know what they say when on vacation, leave your station and... Make a rotation to the whole nation, step it up and eat some bacon. I'm vegetarian. Anyways, cheers. Okay, food is here. I got cacio e pepe, then we got bruschette with burrata cheese and tomato, and then Barbara got the carbonara pasta. No veo nada. Ay, no sé qué comer primero. Quiero todo. Voy con eso. Holy shit. Mm, qué va, qué va. <laughs> Holy shit. Nah. No, hay palabras. There's no words. This is like being in Italy. Wow. <laughs> There's like fresh garlic on there as well. And then the seasoning, las hierbas, queso, oregano. Oregano. This is like one of the best we should have ever had in my life. You know the food's good when you're dancing. Yes, dulce, pero mm -hmm. salado. The tomato is like sweet but salty and just like the perfect bit where it melts in your fucking mouth. Okay, let's try this pasta. Pizza with truffles and parmesan cheese and pecorino cheese as well. The best cacio e pepe that I've ever had was in London. El mejor cacio e pepe de este plato. Bueno, voy a probar. Wow. Wow. All right. If you're coming to Porto and you want crazy good Italian food, this is it, people. 
this is it. A few moments later. This is the best moment of the trip right now. This food is next level. I'm dying. I still have three quarters of the place to go, but I'm determined to finish it. One hour later. Food finished, now it's time for classic European post-dinner or post-lunch coffee. Coffee with Nutella and Cremanata with cream on top because why the fuck not? Barbara's already finished. <laughs> Wow, fuerte, ¿no? Tiene pistacho, ¿no? Tiene un hueso o algo de... Holy ball snacks, this is the next level. What's going on? Como este café, creo que voy a ir al maldición. Pero, hasta tu tía rea, dices. Oh, lo fuerte que es. Oh, llevarás un chip contigo. Only fans o only... Depende. Mierda. Sí, está fuerte. There's a peanut inside. Cacahuete, se dice en español. Pero en Venezuela, maní. The last part on the bottom of coffee is so f***ing strong. I think it's like a double shot. We're both gonna s*** our pants after this. Demolished. Okay, it is finished. Complete, finito. Now I think we're both in a food coma. So we're just gonna go take it easy. We've got like two more hours left until we have to go to the airport. Um, who knows what we're gonna do? I'm tired. We're both tired. The food coma tired, I guess. So we'll see where we end up. Bueno, pensábamos que íbamos a irnos, pero nos ofreció un lemoncello. Mira, es como un digestivo. Un digestivo, sí. Un digestivo. Rest in peace. Vamos. Salud. Mi marido me pesa. <risa> es broma, pero no es broma. No es broma. Ay, Dios. Bueno. Que la gente nos saluda de la calle. Tenemos muchos fans por acá porque esto, estas bellezas de verdad. Las dos vamos a terminar en el suelo. ¿Quieres poner una guerra de, de dos? Ready? One, two, three, four. Add it, put it, thumb, four, five, six, seven, eight, three, two, one, three, two, one. Ahora. Chicos, soy muy bueno. Hago eso con todo el mundo y siempre gano. Uno, dos, tres. Qué fuerte, ¿no? Qué fuerte. Está fuerte, está fuerte. Anyways, a la fuerza y la salud y longevity. I'll see you guys later. Chao. We are walking to the hotel now. It's about a 15 minute walk back. We're both full as f I have a food baby. I'm full on life and full on food. And ready to lie down on a sofa and then hang the f out. I've had five coffees today, so no sleeping on the plane. I'm gonna work, edit, and be productive. Yo yo! Dime que no tenemos que subir esa. Tenemos que subir esa. She's doing the evil laugh. I love hills. I'm here for the hills. This is what I live for. Pure hills. If there's no hills, you don't get the thrills.
A él le gusta, le gusta. We are gonna end the Portugal vlogs here. This is it. If you've made it this far in the video, thank you so much thank for you. watching. Like, yes, like, comment, bye, subscribe. Bye, bye, bye. You already know what it is. Anyways, Barbara. Gracias por ver este video maravilloso. Maravilloso. Like y suscribirte, por favor. Yes, sir. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> Obrigada. <laughs> vale, chao, chicos. Cause it ain't the end of times yet. I know, but it's getting close. Yeah, I need my space to breathe. That's why I be going ghost. I ain't trying to stay up on that wide road Cause I can't let them take my soul Nah, 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 no Oh, I can't let them take my soul Nah, 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 no I can't let them take my soul Nah, 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 no Oh, I can't let them take my soul Nah, 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 no They thinking I'm bluffing But I promise I do it That K got a drum Like murder and booming